Yo. Copy. Paste. No, what am I doing? Uh, no. Going to Discord and sharing the link. Oh, Lord, we're rusty. What the hell happened to Discord? Oh, no. Yeah. Eh? Nah. Yeah, it's dope. Talking about Discord Nitro. At everyone, come at me, bro. Close that off. Time stamps. What the hell are time? Ooh, ooh, that's new. What happened? <clears throat> What's up, y'all? It's Conspiracy Theory Month. No, listen. It is. It is. Um. Just because I don't make it a feature of my music content, it is always conspiracy theory time with me. I just have, <clears throat> I just have a different relationship with uh, conspiracies at this point in my life. <clears throat> like there's, there's like, there's like, there's like stages of of conspiracy theories, right? This is a good one. I got some I got some coffee too. Cuz this is this is very important. Listen, this is this is very important to our to our hip hop journey together, right? Conspiracy you know, hip hop being hip hop being counterculture um counterculture to America. You know what I mean? It's um like if you think about it, if you think about it like something like something like fuck the police, right? Just 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 that song and that sentiment um in released in that time would be would be like conspiracy theory to most of America. Most of America could never um could never like in the late eighties could never fathom an existence where the police were brutalizing and, you know, doing anything that was against the law, you know, that was, that was, um, you know, could be deemed as unfair or bad or criminal heinous or evil. Right. But we all know that that was the truth. And that was like common and accepted knowledge. Um, by people who by people who are woke not like not like what they call woke now but you know what woke used to be you know um so if you were into hip hop you know in the in the 90s you were you were bombarded bombarded with 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 uh, conspiracies um you know five percenters um, Hebrew Israelite lyrics, you know what I mean? Like that, like that shit was all in there. Like if you listen to Wu-Tang, oh my God, like, like that's what, like that's what they meant when they, <laughs> when, when they said you don't have to go to summer school and Wu-Tang's for the children, you know what I mean? Like that's like, that's, you know, 
Camouflage chameleon, did just scale in your building. No time to grab the guns. They already got the wife and children. A hit was sent from the president to raid your residence because you had secret evidence and documents on how they raped the continents. Erased the prominent, dominant, Islamic, Asiatic, Black Hebrew, the year 2002, the battle still with the woo. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like, and, and that was, and that was on a platinum album. They made a video for that song. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I mean? Like they made a music video for that song and put it on MTV after school. <laughs> you know what I mean? And that was just like one of my favorite songs to this day. You know, it it was it it, it like it it was put. I don't think that um, I don't think that the record industry understood like what that was doing to i don't think the record industry understood what that was doing to young people especially like young white hip-hop fans who were under like a completely different type of programming like if you like 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 i seen a comedian and he was he was saying like yo i, I, I miss when like white people were white you know what i mean white people used to go like this you know in a picture and 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 and, and like a guitar solo would play somewhere you know and they would talk like they had like their own accents and you know now they'll run up to you after a show and be like and be like yeah bro that was um you know you know that was you know that was good no cap you know everybody everybody's slang is homogenized everybody's fashion is homogenized you know the, the cultures are are um are together they used to play in bands and give us bops yes shane <laughs> they used to play in bands and give us bops but so it's always it's always conspiracy hours you know what i mean if you're if you're into if you're into hip hop it's 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 always conspiracy hours you're predisposed to that that was i think that was that's a deep part of the program and it's a part of the program that 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 the programmers were not counting on right but uh they've learned how to they've learned how to co-opt that and that's how and they now they use it to their advantage that's how we got shit like QAnon and stuff like that but the point is, the point is, is that at my big age, what I've learned, because I was one of those people who like, who like really, really, really liked the conspiracy stuff when I was younger. I used to, I used to like study it with a passion. You know what I mean? Like you guys that are like just figuring out what the word fiat means like you, you fucking irritate me <laughs> you know what i mean because it's just like it's just like where were you in 2004 bro <laughs> like but um the point is like everything right like uh like how wide leg jeans and chokers are back and loafers um and high-waisted pants, right? Like how the hot girls are wearing fucking bell bottoms and shit. Um, the conspiracy world rolls in predictable patterns. And it's unfortunate because it's just like every other form of entertainment. And there's like there's a few different types of people there's there's the type of person who rolls who rolls like they're not accepting into, into conspiracy vibes so they go straight into cognitive dissonance they're like the they're like the stock npc type of person right like they they're like you know you you would like show them zeitgeist and they couldn't make it past the idea that there were 10 different archetypes of jesus before jesus showed up in history right like they they look at something like zoroasters as zoroastrianism and it's like that's a lie of the devil even though it was before jesus and it you know they like so, so there's that person because they can't uh be um challenged on their beliefs in any way right then there's the type of person who They'll be entertained by it and they can listen to it, but it's just, it just doesn't, it just, 
it just doesn't check out to them. You know what I mean? That's, you know, I think that's the most normal response. Um, and then, then there's like the type of personality to where they're like, oh my God, this is the truth. Everything is a lie, right? And based on, and, and, and there's a subcategory of that type of person and they're even more rare, right? And that's where I think I fit in. So there's this one type of person who's like, okay, everything's a lie. And what they do is they replace their previous dogma. So say they, you know, so say they watch Zeitgeist or something and they realize that, you know, Christianity is astrology and sun worship and they're, and, and they're like, oh, okay, boom, I'm, I'm, I'm off Christianity now, but they used to, but they used to believe in hell and going to hell and, and, and all, and all that stuff. And what they do is they now put, you know, trutherism or being woke or whatever we call it nowadays. And they put that as their new Jesus. And now any alternative information that gets shoveled their way is their Bible. And they don't break off of that. You know what I mean? So, so they find a new source of trusted, of, of trusted information. Like back in, um, back in the early two thousands, it was Alex Jones, a guy named Alan Watt, Jordan Maxwell, um, you know, when they were these, you know, they, they, they would like fashion themselves as like historical researchers, you know, people and, and, and people would go and be really like predisposed to believe everything that these people say, because, you know, they went and did the research and they read and shit like that. But, and then you could go and listen to them and it made you feel like you went and did the research, but you didn't have to do shit. Right. And what, and then, uh, and then, uh, what kind of conspiracies that did, did I read about? I'll, I'll get to that after I, after I do these types of people, right? So those people, a lot of those, a lot of those people, they don't break out of it and they just become the most annoying people to hang out with, right? Like you can't take them to a party because they want to tell you how fluoride's in the water or they want to tell you how you know uh cryptocurrency is the mark of the beast or you have a regular conversation and they're breaking down the etymology of the word that you just said and they are scaring the hoes bro they are scaring the hoes bro like they become professional hoe frighteners they are the michael myers of life right then there's and then there's and then there's the people who are like me right who we I was to say I I love to watch all of that shit I love it it's like a comic book to me you know what I mean because the way that the information gets presented it's so like it's it, it it's so like it's you know you know what they are it's the it's it's the logic of it right they they set up these crazy amazing logic strings and i love and and i like logic like my job is logic like like literally that's that's what i do for a living is i do is i do like a type of i do a type of programming that's th that are all like logic strings so that's the that's what my mind likes to go through in it and and and, and it's fun so i go so i go and you go through these fantastical logic logic strings about these larger than life organizations who have you know done this and done that and done this and done that and there's always <laughs> bro the problem the the what i wind up finding you know like once i got past the like once I got out of the emotional stage of it, because a lot of people don't break out of the emotional stage of it. But once I got past the emotional stage of it and I opened myself up to, you know what? Like I'm sitting here thinking that I'm smarter than everybody because they just can't see the truth. I want to start trying to debunk what is being presented to me, right? Because that's the only way that you can really that 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 you can really like be honest about it. That's the only way that you could really be like scientific. And so I got to do I got to do both things. I got to I I got to like you know deep dive the conspiracy stuff, and then also like stop 
stop stop sounding like a fucking idiot once somebody who had read a book about logic uh came into came into my circle right so the first thing that i did was um I was at my buddy's house and he had just did a course on logic. He had like a, like, you know, like a school textbook on logic to, from college. And I was like, yo, let me get that book, bro. And I read about logic and logic strings and different arguments and, and, you know, and all that type of shit. And I came up, you know, I learned about confirmation bias and circular logic and I was able to identify that stuff. And now when I see it in these, you know, in these in you know in these arguments i can identify grifters faster right and it's fascinating what they do bro um you take somebody you take somebody like alex jones right alex jones is he's he's the way that he the way that he did his stuff like in the, the like when obama was president and uh like when Obama was president and he, he, he was really good. Like before Trump, he was really good at positioning himself as anti-establishment. He would, because he, he railed against George Bush. Right. And back then, if you were my age, like you were against the Iraq war, you didn't want to see your friends, you know, going to war, going to Fallujah, coming back fucked up, you know, losing, you know, losing an arm, having PTSD, like, you know, I mean, you didn't want to see none of that stuff. So we didn't, so we didn't fuck with George Bush and, you know, Alex Jones would be out there. You'd see this fucking madman with a bullhorn, you know, like what, you know, running up on, running up on Freemasons and asking them about Lucifer and they would be all like, you know, and it, and it was crazy. And what this guy used to do on his show was he would have like, he would have, um, he would have like trend reports, right? And his his thing was his thing was he was like, yo, you could go and read this, and he would like say the link, and he would give the link on his website. He used to actually write. He used he used to actually write these uh the he, he used to like write these blogs and have and source them with links, right? So I remember I was laid off in two thousand and eight learning about you know the financial crisis and you know and all that stuff and this dude was doing all of his predictive stuff and i was like yo i'm gonna read one of these trend reports um you know that he's referencing right and it was this trend report and it's funny because this and and, and the reason why i'm talking about this is because this is this is a cycle right so back then he was real big on talking about agenda 21 right which is like a new like my mom keeps on sending me fucking uh, Facebook messages about goddamn <laughs> agenda 2030. I'm like, "Oh my god, it's 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 oh my god, hose is wearing jokers again." Right? So I read this um it was a it was a trend report. It was it, it was either by the Rand Corporation or is another think tank. The first thing that I did was I researched the think tank, right? Okay, so I researched the think tank. I was like, what the fuck is a think tank? Why do they even exist? So think tanks, corporate think tanks exist, like geopolitical think tanks exist because what they do is they game plan all of these scenarios for the purpose of um, uh, like corporations trying to predict uh, geopolitical instability um, so that they can implement it in creating their products and in creating, um, you know, different services and shit like that, right? Johns Hopkins, that's another think tank, right? So, so what people like Alex Jones and the grifters like him would do was they would take, was they, as they would, as they would read these, and he'd have a team of people who would do this, he, is they would read these trend reports and they would pick out the scenarios that seemed likely right so for example alex jones had a five-part series called police state right and they were they were these videos that were talking about the ramping up of of the police state to you know um clamp down on the freedom of the american citizen right and this was after this was after 9 11 and and what where he was getting his information from was in these military, you know, uh, um, uh, trend reports. Uh, they, they were saying they were saying possible scenarios would be that surplus um, military equipment 
built by you know built by like um bechtel and and uh you know and 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 raytheon and all the other military contractors would come back to america decommissioned for use in the police forces to to bolster to bolster potential unrest that would be caused from financial instabilities right so when when you read stuff like that and then you get on a microphone and you say it and you talk to a whole bunch of people who never who've never heard the stuff and then you drive down the street and all of the sudden you you see like the Pembroke Pines police have have you know have Humvees it's it's an eerie experience you're like oh my god dude this guy really might be a prophet he might really he he might he might really know what the fuck he's talking about but he's reading a trend report right and he's challenging you to read the trend report and you're not reading the trend report because he knows that you're a fucking goof you know what i'm saying and so what they do is is they cherry pick these things you know that 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 you're gonna see then they get on the mic and they tell you like yo buy gold okay buy this buy this product to protect yourself against the globalists because they're coming for you and the thing and the thing that all and the thing that all of them tell you the thing that all of them tell you is they're like listen this is coming from an organization who they have to tell you what they're going to do because they worship the devil and when you worship the devil you have to tell people what they're going to do meanwhile meanwhile they can show you the they can show you a link to a trend report they can show you a link to a study that says that you know there's ad there's there's adjuvants in a you know in vaccines and they you know they could show you you know a correlating link to like what happens when vaccine vaccines and autism you know and you know they could show you all that shit but nobody can ever show you the satanic uh what's it called um 10 commandments right you can they, they, no one can ever show you in any like in any like luciferian holy book where it says that they have to tell you what they're going to do right it's that that is like it's like an old wives tale that somebody's made up and i know this is true because i looked for it i looked for the shit like i like dude i'm telling you i was so deep i like i was so deep like do you know do you know why my production company is named craft master productions do you know why <laughs> it's because my name is caution <laughs> that's why okay so so i looked and i didn't find that shit and what they do is they leverage that so that so that so that what so that what so that what they can so that what they can say is like hey you you remember that movie independence day well look it's just like the movie independence day you see it came true <laughs> you know what i'm saying or they'll be like or or, or they'll be like yo you see how they you, you know you see how they sent the uh you, you know you see how they did the so-and-so it's just like that movie vanilla sky you see because they have to tell you the truth and it, bro it's not it's not it's not bro <laughs> yo yo in antitrust rewind bro we started with boom bab <laughs> but uh what kind of what kind of conspiracies did you read about i started bro i started with the damn uh i started with the sumerians like the first the, the the first no i started i i started with the masons then i then i pivoted then i pivoted to the sumerians um is this book called rule by secrecy where it talked about where it talked about how the sumerians were a part of were a part of fucking planet x and and the enlil and enki story yeah i was doing that shit in 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 uh in 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 fucking 11th grade bro <laughs> you know what i'm saying so 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 we do we knew about that um then i got into then i got into behold to pay a horse then i met this uh 
then I met this uh, this bass player. Uh, he was a bass player for the Commodores, and he had he he had he had these crazy videos. He had he had them videos about concentration camps in America and shit like that. And we were and we were watching those like like before before there was stuff on on the internet. And it was it was a wild time, bro. But but the point is the point is like all all of that shit is a loop, bro. It's 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 all a loop. Like I remember when like this is like this is the point where I super gave up was when was when that rise of the more shit was coming out and they were do and they were using the same information that the sovereign citizens were doing when they were all getting locked up. And I was like, I was like, oh my God, bro. Like this is this is nuts, bro. Like I can't. I can't anymore. This is this is crazy. This is just this is just not happening. Let me download this this plugin while I talk to you guys about this. Because uh because we're doing us. Conundrum says, What's up, bro? I had a three months phase where I paid attention to all the conspiracies and run, not that I realized no one who was super into was living the way I wanted to live, so I got off it quick. Yes, bro, they're all broke. <laughs> Let's talk about it, bro. They're all fucking broke, dude. They're all broke and mad, and they're like and they're like blaming their situation on the Illuminati, dog. And it's <laughs> And it's nuts, bro. This shit is this shit is sad. This shit is like this shit is like wild sad. Hold on, let me uh let me, let me jump into my account here and download the old demo tape. Oh, they'll let me they'll let me get a plugin I don't need for forty dollars, bro. How you guys doing on your journey? Are you guys still in the uh are you guys still buying plugins? Or if, or if you uh I respect the struggle, but you all fronting these days. What you mean, Dottrell? What are we talking about? Do, 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 do. How do I get the demo to this? Yeah, this is the Arteria one. Put the last plugin you bought in the chat. I want to see who's lying. <laughs> I want to see who's lying, bro. I, kn I know y'all are lying. Get free demo. Oh, it's a Cole lyric. Bro, you know I don't listen to Cole unless he's featuring with another rapper. I thank God I got out my conspiracy bag before I lost any real leaders. Yeah, bro. I mean, dude, everybody like I, the, the, I, I was saying before. I, I I was saying before. Um, like the reason why I even started talking about it. I was saying before, like like uh, conspiracy vibes. Cause like if you're if 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 you're into if you're into hip hop, you're going to get bit by the conspiracy bug. Was my basic was my basic uh thesis and then depending on what type of person you are if you're a cognitive dissonance person you'll 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 believe it but if you're like emotional and 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 you need and and you need like meaning in your life then that shit fucking takes over bro <laughs> that shit takes over like if you down bad going on looking you know looking for purpose don't got no kids like don't got no woman like this whew, that shit that shit could take you over quick bro i got into the cia gateway shit for a while i need to i need to know what you're talking about that shit seems spl iron that's a good buy i ain't mad at you Phase plant? What is phase plant, Ram? That's one of those. That's yo, you, bro. The the, the Weaver Beats community, y'all got the crazy plugins. 
take a look into the gateway process. <laughs> New rabbit hole. <laughs> I'm gonna write that down. Yeah. Oh, is that the is that the uh is that the fucking is that the brain sink thing? Bro, Ram, were you trying to sink your brain? Were you <laughs> were, were were you trying to sink your brain, bro? This is a safe place. You could you could, <laughs> yeah. yeah yeah yeah. I got I I got to circle back on that. I I I started on that. Remember Zeitgeist and use and lose change, bro. Zeitgeist and lose chains made a generation of made a generation of people lose their shit, bro. Bro, Zeitgeist and lose change had us. Zeitgeist and lose change had me outside passing out DVDs at NBA Finals games instead of going in to see the NBA Finals. That's that's how fucked up Zeitgeist and loose change had me, bro. UA, UAD pull text. The UAD pull text. Yo, listen, guys. You guys that got the UAD pull text, you take the UAD pull, te pull text and you put that shit anything, like whether you're using a bass guitar or a sub bass, just put it on your bass and listen. Arturia LX reverb. Yeah, no, bro. <laughs> Yo, bro, do you still use Ableton Live? Yo, it's funny that you mentioned that. I was like, I, I was getting a little Ableton Live bug today. I was like, man, I use Ableton Live in a minuto. I was thinking about making a template. Yeah, I, yeah, Stefan on on all of my te on on every one of my templates, whether it's a bass track or an eight hundred eight track, the uh, the pull tech is on there. I'm dead at giving out DVDs. Nah, bro, I, bro, I was one of those like 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 bro. That's why I that's why I don't respect like pussy ass conspiracy YouTubers, bro. Because I was I was like I was like one of them people that like went outside and debated. You know what I'm saying? Like, like I was one of those people. I, <laughs> I was like, I, I, I was bad, bro. I was one of them. I, I, I was a truther, bro. Like a real one, bro. I wanted to be. I, I wanted to be. I wanted to be like Luke Radowski, bro. It was like, like all the way up until fucking, uh, all the way up until, uh, what's it called? Um, Occupy Wall Street, and then I, and then I started tapping out. I was like, wait a minute, bro. Let me. Let me do a little bit more research before I go, <laughs> before, before I go, before I go jeopardizing my life, dog. Oh, where is this? Locations. Yo, yo, the lead up to the lead up to 2012 was crazy. I they never got me with with 2012, bro. 2012 didn't make sense because because I was already on the they met they fucked up the years type of vibe. Like I didn't like I didn't need Tartaria to 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 make me think of that. So I was like I was like I was like nah, bro. Like this is this is this is cap. We're gonna be fine. But man, what was crazy? What was crazy was fucking crystal chicks back then, and they were all like, you know, like believing that you know the energy was changing. I'm, I'm, I'm talking a lot. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, bro. Anyway, yo, Coney 2012. <laughs> yo, yo, Coney 2012, bro. <laughs> oh my god what am i doing i'm looking for studio i'm looking for the studio one folder bro i had i had this one crystal chick and she was like bro she wouldn't give that shit up until like 2017 bro like she was oh my god oh my god it was so bad 
It was so bad. That was my baby, though. I miss her. She's so crazy. I had a on my collar when I was selling my mixtape for $5 walking around the gas station in Houston eating the $2 fried burritos every 30 minutes, bro. <laughs> I did, bro, I didn't I had I had one year like that conundrums and I I survived strictly on gas station hot dogs and fucking Jamaican patties, bro. That was a rough time. That was that was a bad year. That was my that was my I don't have a car year. You live in Texas, so it's similar. Like you, you, you're you're dead without a car in driving states. CMP on the median with the sign, you know, about the end times is crazy. Yo, I, I bro, Dontrell, I used to be good at it, dude. Like I used to, I used to have like. What I used to do was I had like a broad range of of topics that I could talk about. And I would like, you know, what I mean, like if you were a new parent, talk about like Monsanto or like or like vaccines and shit like that. You know what I mean? If you were, you you know, if you were if if you were in the military, talk about like PTSD and shit like that. And then, you know, try to wind you down to, have you ever heard of thermite? Did you know the jet fuel doesn't burn? <laughs> doesn't burn. Doesn't burn hot enough to melt steel. <laughs> Did you know the three buildings went down on nine 11? <sighs> oh. And what's crazy is I didn't do like, is I didn't do like I did not do terrible with the ladies, which makes me so mad because if I was not wasting my fucking powers of persuasion on trying to get people to see the esoteric truth and look behind the veil. And if I was just being a, a normal red blooded Puerto Rican fucking male, you know, I mean, who knows how many kids I would have right now? I'm just saying. I'm just saying, bro. I guarantee I guarantee you I'd be at least three baby mamas deep. So maybe it saved me. I don't know. All right, where is this plug in? Let's make a little let's make a little melody. Can't hear shit. You guys hear something? Oh, we going through the uh we going through the gear. Let's turn the gear on. Why not? It's not hot outside. What is that? Fucking phasers in analog lab. <laughs> Talking about loose change with no loose change in your 
in your pockets with sick times. Yo, I definitely did not have any loose change in my pockets, fam. It was bad. It was bad. It was it, it, it was down the baddest, bro. Like my whole life felt like that melody. <laughs> Shit was awful. This shit was awful. Maybe that's maybe that's why all my music sounds like that. Cause I'm just like I'm just like I'm just recapturing that that fucking dirtbag era, you know, when everything was simple, when all I had to do was wake up and figure out how to buy a pack of new ports and a Jamaican beef patty. <laughs> I didn't do no. We, I did not ask for no spare change. I need. I need yo, now we getting disrespectful, Ram. I need you to relax. this shit called motions fx motions ah oh, thank you for trying software is not activated it's kind of a license for fx motions yeah well that's because we're using the demo would you like to take a quick tour of some of the features sure show me the features how do I? Yeah, that's what we want to do. Okay, why is this telling me symbols? Okay, so introduction, overview. How do I go to the next page? Oh, welcome to motions. Uh, motions processors, modules come with dedicated modulars. C modulators, sorry. Capable. Oh my God, there's this guy at work. So. We have these things called modules and he calls them modulars. And every time he calls them modulars, I just, I like, I want to headbutt him, but he's so much bigger than me that that would just be poor for my well being. So I just have to take it. I just have to, I just have to listen to this person say modulars because I, I don't know how to correct him without offending him. It's a problem. Uh, modules come with dedicated modulators capable of everything from adding subtle movement to driving powerful rhythmic patterns of your sound. Where they, man, shut up. Okay, so what do we got? We got folders, module tab selectors. Okay, so da -da 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 -da. tips, dedicated mod each processor module features both an advanced envelope generator capable of producing everything from a saw waveform to a complex rhythmic patterns. That's this guy right here. Uh, utilizing these modulators to introduce movement. So it's so it's all ah oh, this. You know what this is, bro? This is put an LFO on anything. Okay. I worked with somebody who called electroids, <laughs> electrodes, electroids. 
Conundrum says, I feel like they ran out of ideas for this plugin because it looks like it looks like some shit I've seen people review. Yeah, no, this is this is listen, we definitely we definitely all have this plugin. So basically. So basically we can put a we can put an LFO on a filter which we know that from doing since we could put an LFO on noise. We could put an LFO on distortion. We could put an LFO on volume. We could put an LFO on fan, uh, on pan. That's what we're, that's what we're getting so far. Right. Yep. Oh, what does the advanced panel do? Oh, <laughs> What's in there? And then you can compare. All right. Exit the tutorials. So what is it? What is this bullshit? So these are macros. I have no idea. I have no idea what this is doing. All right. Let's press play. <laughs> I'm listen right now. I'm 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 just saying it. This is the best plugin of 2023, right? The reason why is because it has the most appropriately named preset, maybe of all time. Okay, so we just wrote a guitar melody, right? Simple guitar melody and went to the drill guitar preset and i just want you in your mind right as i press play i just want you to hear tick 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 right just 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 put that over what we have here <laughs> Tell me I lied, bro. <laughs> Tell me that I lied to you. They put they put uh they put looperator in it too. They put looperator in it. effects what happens if I do this
Yo, so my question, my question to you is like, why does like why does it have to be at the end of like Southside and TM eighty eight? Like, why does it gotta be at the end of their era that the Germans figure out to give people the effect to do all that stuff easily? You know what I mean? Like, like, what do we do it here, bro? Like, this is like, this is, um, you know, like back when, back when everybody wanted to do like, uh, you know, like back when everybody wanted to like, like get a whole bunch of Bart Simpson, uh, pictures and make a tight beat page, you know what I mean? And, 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 and make a whole bunch of like, you know, trap money, Benny type beats or whatever the fuck, you know? We started making presets. Oof. Oof. Soul Avery. <laughs> Soul Avery. I fuck with that. That checks out. Because that's like, like, that's what this is, bro. Like, don't call this effects motions. Like, we know what this is, bro. <laughs> but this is, you know what's crazy? Like this is the 808 Mafia VST, bro. This is the, this is this is the Southside VST, but y y you know, like this is like that, like that's what the shit is, bro. Hold on, because this is going to piss me off now, bro. This is going to piss me off now. Why, why are they doing this? This is not Whole Foods effect tricks, bro. This is uh
this is like, bro, this is the fucking 808 Mafia VST, bro. But it's like, it's like all the, it's like, you know, because in order, in order to do that shit, them guys had to like master effect tricks, you, you master effects tricks. You know what I'm saying? Like they had to, it, it, they, they had to master Looperator. They had to master, um, uh, what's it called? Um, uh, the goofy FL Studio plugin that only lets you do one bar. Um, gross beat, right? Um. And they went, they went in because it's because it's the most recent. They have the, they have the, um, they have the advantage, they have the advantage of looking back at what. At what worked and stuff like that. I'm done. I'm done, bro. <laughs> oh my god, bro. Should we do it? Should we do it? Yeah, it makes sense. French, this is him. Bro, this is... This is... Bro, call that, call that shit Nardo Wick, bro. <laughs> You know, you, you know, you know what that preset is called. Oh my God! And of course, and of course, they have it in the. Uh... Bro, they got hi hat rolls. <laughs> they got hi hat rolls, bro. Let's go. <laughs>
Jesus Christ. That shit is a fucking... Bro, they need to call that... They need to... <laughs> Bro, I'm telling you. They need to, like... They need to just stop playing. And just... The time limit of my demo has been reached. Wow. Wow. Wow, you crazy. You, look at that. They do it, they, bro. They do that shit. They do that shit like a straight up, like a straight up, like DMT hit, bro. Like, you go out, see the elves, and then you come back and you're like, wait a minute, I just want to talk to the elves again, bro. I have so many questions. So many questions. I have so many questions. And then you got, <laughs> are they going to make me listen to my melody without it? Now I got to listen to this bullshit, bro. <laughs> How dare you? How dare you? Come on, man. This see, I don't know who the fuck y'all thought y'all were watching. <laughs> y'all were watching. <laughs> y'all y'all thought y'all were watching somebody else. It wasn't me. Yeah, it wasn't me. Couldn't be me. Oh, you fucking piece of shit. There you go, right there. I hate you. Here, here. Eh, eh. Let's see if this does it. <laughs> I think Effectrix has a straight reverse. Yeah, I don't think they have a straight reverse. They don't. Unless, oh, can you do a? Oh, you can. Maybe you can do a user. How do you? How do you do the? How do you do? Is it here? No. No. How do you how do you edit these shits? There it is right here. Boom. Not no, so there's no and itch.
I'm not learning how to use this right now, but. That's right. He said, this is vintage shit I like to see. <laughs> uh, remove. But they got they got the reverse and effect tricks, and, and they got that shit here. Like I said, you just fucking hit it with a little. Hit it with a little bombo. Select every other. Yeah, it was bro. They, they was trying to get me to get Guitar Rig Seven in my uh in my Discord, bro. Trying to have me jumping out the gym. Ice verb. Is this from Machine? Is this the is this the bro? Did they put the machine reverb in in goddamn bro? Did they put the machine one reverb inside of inside a guitar rig and tell me it's rain? sleeping on even tide even tide just don't sell us shit for 50 bucks bro <laughs> you know you know what time it is bro even tide doesn't sell us shit for 50 dollars
this loop with as many trap cliches as I possibly can. Tell me this is the polo snare. Tell me this is the polo snare. There we go. There we go. You know what I'm looking for this whole time. Y'all know exactly what I'm looking for. Yo, Shane got to relax because I know Shane is having fun. Why would you? Bro, these guys were such idiots back then, bro. This like like this is so dumb. Why would you make a one shot kit and fucking not tune the shit to see? You know? Why would you do this to people? <laughs> Shade says you really bring back boom bap. Oh no, Shade. Nah, that's bullshit because if I put a sexy red acapella on this, Shane, you'd be all about it. <laughs> See? See? <laughs> See, you full of shit. <laughs>
<laughs> yeah. <laughs> Yo, Shane. <laughs> what are you doing? What are you doing? Bro, what is this beat? This dude, this dude made the beat that I was joking around about making for serious, bro. Oh my god, bro. <laughs> oh my god. No, you were right, bro. You were right. You were 100% right, bro. That dude, that dude sat down at at his computer and really and really fucking he pulled out the BG post cash money sounds and we're like and we're like this this is what we're doing. <laughs> That is, that's amazing. <laughs> that's, that is amazing. I tell you what. Check me in the pilot, but naked tanning on island. These niggas flexing that cap. Lotto ain't catching nobody. G5 check me in the pilot, but naked tanning on island. These niggas flexing that cap. Lotto ain't catching nobody. G5 check me in the pilot, but naked tanning on island. These niggas flexing that cap. Lotto ain't catching nobody. G5. Is that is is like is that what I should be doing instead of boom bad beef? Should I should I go back to like <laughs> should, I, should, should should that be the next season? The next season will be uh the dirty south era. Is that where we should take it? Let's see here. Is that what happened? Like people, like people looked at what people looked at what Griselda was doing, and it was like, you know what, we're gonna do that, but in the South. We're just gonna do a whole bunch of young jock beats. I can see it. Updating studio. Uh... Lotto 
Oh, dope bitch, gelato Ho on my dick for a follow Nasty little bitch and I swallow Drink that shit straight out the bottle Fuck it, I'm running shit up Merkel rap bitch is a must Two-tone Glock in the tub G5 check me in the pilot But naked tanning on island These nigga flexing that cap Lotto ain't catching nobody Good head ain't been in no college Bitch on some pressure, I'm solid Clutch always popping like Molly And all my bitches exotic I'm from the south side Bougie bitches and dope boys I'm from the south side Riverdale out the Lord Joy I'm from the south side Popping shit like I run shit I'm from the south side Not the two, I'm the one Bitch, Panaman coming out terror Audemars cost a Camaro Whole thing she fucking with Lotto Bitch can't see me in the mirror Stepping on shit in these Christians Palm Angels on me, I'm sinning Hit up South Lake in my bed Point South straight to the millions Been cutting checks like Johnny Been copping, been getting money Know these bitches barely getting by Big Lotto chain drop the honey <laughs> Yo <laughs> Yo, why did Why did Ant troll the Trap Lord Back into fucking <laughs> Why did you troll the trap lord back, bro? He was asleep. Big lotto, dope in gelato. Ho on my dick for a follow. Nasty little bitch and I swallow. Drink that shit straight out the bottle. Fuck it, I'm running shit up. Merkel rap bitch is a must. Two tone Glock in the tub. Big lotto, dope in gelato. Ho on my dick for a follow. Nasty little bitch and I swallow. Drink that shit straight out the bottle. Fuck it, I'm running shit up. Marco rap bitch is a mud for a follow. Nasty little bitch and I swallow. Drink that shit straight out the bottle. Fuck it, I'm running shit up. Marco rap bitch is a mud. Two tone Glock in the tub. Modulation. Big lotto, dope in gelato. Ho on my dick for a follow. Nasty little bitch and I swallow. Drink that shit straight out the bottle. Fuck it, I'm running shit and I swallow. Drink that shit straight out the bottle. Fuck it, I'm running shit and I swallow. Drink that shit straight out the bottle. Fuck it, I'm running shit up. Marco rap bitch. And I swallow Drink that shit straight out the bottle Fuck it, I'm running shit up Drink that shit straight out the bottle 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 Fuck it, drink that shit straight out the bottle 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 Fuck it, I'm running Drink that shit straight out the bottle Fuck it, drink that shit straight out the bottle Fuck it, I'm running shit up Drink that shit straight out the bottle Fuck it, I'm running shit up Marco rap bitch is a must Two-tone Glock in the tub
one bitch Panamera coming out terror Audemars Casa Camaro Hold that She fucking with Lotto Bitch can't see me in the mirror Stepping on shit in these Christians Palm Madras on me, I'm sitting Hit up South Lake in my bed The points out straight to the millions Then cut checks like Johnny Then copy, then getting money Know these bitches barely getting by Big Lotto chain, drop the honey Reds roll, back to flat shows Back to back to back to back shows Back to back to lamb man the road To the millions Then cut checks like Johnny Then copy, then getting money Know these bitches barely getting by Big Lotto chain, drop the honey Reds roll, back to flat shows Back to back to back to back shows Back to back the lamb and the road, old net back to clay go. Bitch, I'm from the south side. Who's your bitches and dope boys? I'm from the south side, Riverdale out of Love Joy. I'm from the south side, poppin' shit like I run shit. I'm from the south side, not the two, I'm the one, bitch. I'm from the south side, who's your bitches and dope boys? I'm from the south side, Riverdale out of Love Joy. I'm from the south side, poppin' shit like I run shit. I'm from the south side, not the two, I'm the one, bitch. What's up, guys? Yo, did Ant get back out of jail? <laughs> you said they were getting too familiar with the sound. You had to restore the feeling. We had to. We, we, we had to remind them what type. What uh? We had to remember where we're from. We had to bring them back to the south side. Yo, is that is that a thing though? Is that is 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 that what's happening? Is that's is that is that what we're doing? We're making fucking post cash money BG type beats, like what is this beat? A bitch and I swallow. Drink that shit straight out the bottle. Fuck it, I'm running shit up. Marco rap bitch is a must. Two tone Glock in it tuck. G5 check me in the pilot. But naked tanning on alley. G nigga flexing that cap. Lotto ain't catching nobody. Good head ain't been in no college. Bitch on some pressure, I'm solid. Click all we popping like Miley. And all my bitches exotic. I'm from the south side. Who's your bitches and dope boys? I'm from the south side. Riverdale out the love joy. I'm from the south side. Popping shit like I run shit. I'm from the south side, not the two, I'm the one, bitch. Panamera coming out, terror. Audemars, Casa Camaro, whole thing she. Like, bro, you've got that verse, and you and you gave her the the bloop, 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 bloop. You gave her like literally, this man gave her the BWB fucking 2011 kit, like. He didn't even pick the good sounds. Oh, it's a Gucci Mane remake? Okay. All right. I'll excuse it then. I'll excuse it. So, so she do a mixtape style. Okay. Thank God. Vet passed by. Okay. 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 Are y'all feeling the West Side Gun album? Yes. Yes. I like I like the West Side Gun album. I like the I like the Take Keith beats. I like to take key beefs. I mean, everybody who's everybody who's dope says they made the album of the year. <clears throat> but it's nice. I mean, I've listened. I've 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 listened to it. Uh. I've listened to it like I like bro like like the like the refined rap critic in me wants to say that the killer mike is better music but I listen to this more 
Like I listen, like I like like I feel like the Killer Mike is the uh, is the to pimp a butterfly this year. You know what I'm saying? It's it's like the music that you know is great, and you're supposed to say that is better than everything. You know, and it, and it is, but like, bro, I like I can't stop listening to this. You know what I don't got patience for? Like I see, like I see, like people say that that West Side Gun. <laughs> I, I see people say that say the West Side Gun, um, like like didn't um like didn't ride this beat, bro. It that is fucking like Gucci Mane's old flow, bro. Like I don't like. There's nine thousand songs of Gucci Mane rapping like that. And a whole bunch of people calling them classics, but if an East Coast dude does it, then it's like, oh, he's not right. It's like, dude, bro, shut up. It's like I remember when I remember when Gucci Mane was on. Um, fuck, what was the raw song? It was MC Hammer. It was it, when he was on MC Hammer, and like the East Coast people were talking about how like how it wasn't good. I'm like, no, 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 bro. And I remember I used to spit that verse. Like I would have that argument with people, and I used to spit that verse in Cameron's voice, and it would fuck people up. It would fuck them up because the same words that Gucci Mane said when you say them in Cameron's vo vo voice. All of a sudden, to like an East Coast person, it's like, oh, that's crazy! Wow, that is a good cam verse. Gucci MLB jersey, who you be? I be. Yeah, dude, no, he, he, he fucking smashed it. But you know what pisses me off on this album? You know what? You know what made me furious? This right here. This song sounds so fucking bad, bro. Like, this song sounds like one of y'all mixed it. Like, I have, I have, I don't even, they didn't even put his name in here, but whoever mixed this song, I got a problem with them, bro. Like, why does it sound like this? Back to back, roaches with the top sauce. Poppy steak schnitzel with some hot sauce. Vic Dan Ross on the shot off. These niggas praying on my downfall. Snitches in the news, still in a booby trap. I made a strip of my masseuse. Still be shopping careless. Million while in Paris. Mimosas for the moment. All the murders out of Mary. Watch 300. Like that, that, bro, that shit is so terrible, bro. Like when Ross gets on the track, it's supposed to sound like, bro, that's not what it's supposed to sound like when Ross gets on the track, bro. Like it's, no. 
That's not what it's supposed to sound like when Ross gets on the track. Take him everywhere. I'm MC Hammer. Started selling dope. I'm too legit to quit. When it's hammer time, I'm pulling at the stick. I'm at the car line. Like, it don't bother me that much because the rest of the LP covers it up. Facts, bro. But the way that I wish I, I, I wish that I experienced it like that because I would enjoy it more. But because everything else sounds so good, that shit just like jumps out. You know what I mean? And I, you know, I'm from South Florida. I fucking love Rick Ross music. You know what I mean? I want to hear him with West Side Gun. You know, I and 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 they're on a South beat. You know, they were in. You know, they and and I just felt like you know they were supposed to go into Rick Ross world, and it wasn't Rick Ross world. Like they went into like they didn't go to like they didn't go to Miami. They didn't go to fucking Carroll City. They went to the metaverse. You know what I'm saying? Like. The shit pissed me off so much, bro. This shit's hard. Like, oh, we know what high frequencies are now. But like, 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 like now, now we got the high frequencies going. This is like, that's one of those, oh my God, I fucking love songs like this, bro. Like, this is one of those, this is one of those movie songs, you know what I mean? Where, like, like they, like, how do I explain it? If you ever, like, wrote songs with people or been around people who wrote songs, when two people write a song, like, together, it. It, it, it they come out really good when they come from like a natural conversation right so if you're sitting around like it, it, like talking like i like there's a story about devil with a new dress how that song came from like they were all in hawaii and it's the reason why Con, uh, kanye used to do these writing camps like this where you know it was him and rick ross and they were sitting down having breakfast just like talking about women and relationships and then, like, like they, you know, like Kanye did his parts, and then, and and then Ross did his parts, and it's like, you could tell that this came from, like, talk, like a couple of guys talking about, you know, the difference, like who, like who knows how how it could have started, but they could have been somewhere and been like, yeah, this shit reminds me of like being in the kitchen under the kitchen light back at buffalo and it's like bro if you like you know like everybody like everybody's kitchen light it you know if if you ever like lived in apartments like like you know you know what they're talking about 
you know what they're talking about. It's the fucking lights that have it. it, it it's like a it's like a plastic film. They, you know, they, it, it's it, it shit that was like in the late seventies, early eighties that would be everywhere. You know what I mean? It's a fluorescent light behind it, and then it's like this plastic, like yellowy film that like purposely tinted the light in, in, in the space. It usually came along with like you know the fake wood, um, um, cabinets with like with like the the bad brass fittings and shit like that. I could see it. Do you know what I mean? And if you um But that's why that's why the raw song pisses me off so much, bro, because you've got like cinematic shit <laughs> like that happening. And then this bullshit. All you would have had to have done was turn down the fucking 808, bro. You see, you turn that 808 down a little bit. Let everything else sing. Let me get a little bit more highs. Spread them shits out. But you know, Monday morning quarterbacking. You know, who knows? I, 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 I might have fucked it up too, bro. And, you know, who knows? You know what I haven't listened to yet? I haven't. Because I listen to the West Side Gun so much, I have not. I have not. I don't, I don't even know what this is about. Oh, he's Michael Jackson. Look at that. That's crazy. Let's see, he's got Banes mixing his stuff. So this shit probably sounds good. Let's see, he got Boy Wonder Track. He got Metro Boomin. Oz Boy Wonder Metro Boomin. He's the, the, bro, this the <laughs> Des Wright and Offset as the producers. Boy Wonder and OZ. A lot of Boy Wonders. Huh. What do, what do we listen to? Do we listen to Boy Wonder or do we listen to OZ? Wonder? Okay. The fuck is this 808, bro? What is that? <laughs> what is that, dog? What is that? Notice. I know I'm gonna pop by myself, ain't no code offense. Code Can't fake kick it, they know I'm the fucking real. Came from swerving high bosses on gym. Skipping chemistry, now I'm a chemist. Okay. Ain't no cap in my run, no, I live it. No cap. We spend rackets on gallery dental. We gon' load up with sticks and shins out of the room. Had to stay down the stack and my name don't got beat. I hit a lick, I'm tryna make a way. I'm tryna slide, it's time to go skate. Oh, somebody dying. Set up the weight, they mama keep crying. They get back amazing. Keep that shit screwed, yeah, I came from the pavement. Get them wet when I'm sending no payment. Let them chop a sign like a cadence. We ain't have a chance, we had to take it. Woke up this morning, boys in my bed. Coming through hundreds, it's cramping my hand. Yo, be gone, I know she a fan. Go get your dope, it be wrapped in saran. Back to back cash, you know gang ain't playing. If he a op, you can't save him, ain't sparing. Bitch, you ain't never been in the McLaren. I got two bitches like Bluetooth by pound. We on the boat, we in Skyamin penthouse with your hoe. I would go hit a lit when I was broke. Wrong with the Migo gang, all that I know. Came with the shit and get hung by a rope. We got the weed and the dog and the coat. Niggas one day we was robbing the north. Pistol P, bless his soul. Free to the losses, I can't let it go. I go crumb harder than this bitch. Don't like this. 
Hop in the track, call slide. slide. Bulletproof, I don't gotta hide. Bulletproof. Glock for the disc, gon' burn the nigga. Burn. Five, five, six, he fried. fried. I ain't tryna kick it, don't hang with niggas. Huh. Cutting off all loose ties. Off. Niggas be rats and lies. Rats. Giving out bullets no matter your size. Huh. Bit dog get you stepped on. Bit dog. Bit dog get you wet. wet. Bit dog get your wife gone. Bit dog, Bit dog give a back. Huh. Bit dog play with millions. Nigga, I'm a bit dog to the max. max. Bit dog having that money. 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 I walk in the room and they eat it up. Ooh. Hit your gang at the table, can't eat with us. Gang. 300k on the bench, truck. We yeah. do not care about your game, but not beef with us. Huh. She fucking with lanes, wanna leave with us. Please. We posting the flame and they eat it up. Flame. I ordered the bravo, 200 more thousand. I spent a little 50 to geek it up. Geek. If you smoking your heart, nigga, speak it up. Speak. Nigga, talk about it. I got young niggas already caught about it. Caught I don't fought on the bitch and forgot about Who? it. He got left on the block, he a porta potty. Bought the lamb with the dough, coming suicidal. We gon' spend on it. He got left on the block, he a porta potty. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh no. Hold on, wait. <laughs> Hold on, hold on, did y'all see? <laughs> hold on, did y'all see? Uh... Wait, did I just see what I thought I seen? Oh, get it. No, they didn't do it. No. Out of the tongue, uh, trying to give two cents, but the pain are worth a penny. Weight upon shoulder heavy. Weighing options still a result, your soul are feeling empty. How much of these? How much of these psychos charging for this? They better. They better be charging like two thousand dollars for it. Do not go around giving people a CL1B for no eight hundred dollars. Twelve hundred bucks. That is fucking fair. That's crazy, bro. That's crazy. That is insane. That's crazy. That is, that is nuts. This is absolutely nuts. This is, this is not for making beats though. This is not for making beats. This is for recording microphones. That's crazy. That's nuts, bro. These people are... What a time to be alive, bro. That's not... Lions going to the NFC Championship. And, and and you weren't agreeing with me, but you know they go, they going, man. Like they done had their ups and downs in previous years, pause. But you know they done beat a lot of teams, boy. Yeah, pause. you know what I'm saying. With the five a bunch of Yankees, five Yankees, yeah, everybody had the ups and downs. But you know what I'm saying. Five times, pause. Hey, I wanna I wanna say something back, but I don't I don't know what the fuck you said though. Like I, I all right, understand. look. So basically, you know what I'm saying? I'm five for the, the, the five and the ten, you know, the ups and downs. You know, makes you want to be the one see you doing good. <laughs> yeah. Yo, the mace want to be the one to see you doing good is out of line, bro. Why they do mace like that? And then I catch a ball, but sitting down from watching. Wait, the sounds, I was saying, shit, showers. Pause. Shit, nigga, I don't. Hey, speaking of ups and downs, you know the Broncos. What y'all say about Broncos? Y'all found my Bronco?
Hey, what's up, OJ? Now nah, we we was actually talking about the football. Team. Oh, y'all talking about football, football. Hell yeah, you know I love me some football. <laughs> I used to kill. You mean in football, right? <laughs> Say what? You used to kill in football. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. You are football and football. Yeah, I was just talking about Detroit. Did did you see the last game? Oh no, nah, I ain't even about to lie, bro. I was out glove shopping, bro. You think these fit? I mean, they look kind of snug, but hey, is that murder mace? Yeah. <laughs> Bro, you my favorite rapper, Murder Mace. Yeah, you know, Mace, me and him go way back. We came up together, you know what I'm saying? It was Murder Mace and Killer Cam. Oh, my God, bro. I lo bro, I love it, bro. Hey, Murder Mace and Killer Cam. Bro, you know what? I mean, I've been when I was locked up, I started rapping too, bro. I think we should get in a group together, bro. We have, we got, I can keep the theme going. So it's Murder Mace, Killer Cam, and OJ. I mean, you just going to go by OJ, though? Like, you don't want to try nothing like... Uh, like that, like oh no, nah, I'm just go by OJ. Don't you know what I'm saying? Like it's Murder Mace and Killer Cam. Yeah, cause it go with the theme. It's like OJ, Murder Mace, Killer Cam. OJ, <laughs> OJ mean the same thing. <laughs> All right, uh, shit. Uh, I see you getting ready for Halloween. What you mean? Uh, I see, I see you. You got your costume on for Halloween. In the uh, fuck are you talking about, Cameron? I ain't wearing no costume. So what? You don't even celebrate no devil worshiping holiday like that. Halloween. The fuck you talking about? What's wrong with this man? Hey, where my money at, Puff D? Life's tough. Make it harder. Pause. Pink horsepower. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, that's the best one I've seen in a long time, bro. That's the best one I've seen in a long time. Oh my god. Yo, why does my troll trap beat sound good though? Like we need to we need to have a one day we need to have a serious discussion. Of why this even sounds good. There's the little bitch and I swallow. Try that shit straight out the bottle. Fuck it, I'm running shit up. Merkel rap bitch is a must. Two tone Glock in it tough. G5 check me in the pilot. But naked tanning on Alice. These niggas flexing that cap. Lotto ain't catching nobody. Good head ain't been in no college. Bitch on some pressure, I'm solid. Click all we popping like Molly. And all my bitches is out I'm from the south side. Who's your bitches and dope boys? I'm from the south side. Riverdale out of love, joy. I'm from the south side. Popping shit like I run shit. I'm from the south side. Not the two, I'm the one, bitch. Panama coming out terror. Audemars cost a Camaro. Whole thing she fucking with Lotto. Bitch can't see me. Me in the mirror, stepping on shit in these Christians. Tom Andrews on me, I'm sitting. Hit up South Lake in my bed. Point South straight to the millions. Big cut checks like Johnny. Big popping, big getting money. Know these bitches barely getting by. Big lotto chain, drop the honey. Reds roll, back to flat shows. Back to back to back to back shows. Back to back to Lamb Manor Road. Old net back to Clay Go. Bitch, I'm from the South Side. Who's your bitches and dope boys? I'm from the South Side. Riverdale out of Love Joy. I'm from the South Side. Popping shit like I run shit. I'm from the South Side. I'm not the two, I'm the one, bitch I'm from the south side, bougie bitches and dope boys I'm from the south side, Riverdale out of love, joy I'm from the south side, popping shit like I run shit I'm from the south side, I'm not the two, I'm the one, bitch It's the fucking it's the eight oh eight mafia sound effects that that make you that that make you feel like this is like a real beat, you know. Instead of instead instead of a forty year old man making a beat inside Studio One, bro. <laughs> oh man, but. I think I'm gonna run this loot grind on on uh on Gotham Knights because Yo, you know what, bro? I gotta tell you something. These fucking video game reviews They're like worse than like plug-in reviews, bro. Because 
I feel like people just like cut on their camera as soon as a video game comes out, and if it and if it's not like perfect on PC, all of, all of them dudes just like rush to say that it's like the worst game ever. But like, I was excited for 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 a new like you know Gotham game. You know, just go around beating people up, slamming people. Slamming people into the ground, and I didn't get this game because they were like, "Yo, this shit's trash. It's trash. It's so bad. It's so bad. It's so bad." And uh, and like, yo, I actually played it, and like, and like, one, it is not like any of the Arkham games, and the combat is different, but it's still it's still fun as fuck, bro. Like, I'm fucking walking around as Red Hood. With two non-lethal pistols, just just fucking blasting people, and then running up on them and kneeing them in the face, and and it's still, and it's still it it it's still just as it's still just as fun. Like it's it's not as a good it, like like Arkham like Arkham City is is like better as a game, bro. You know what I mean? But I still want to leave early. I still want to leave my fucking job early and sit in front of the PlayStation. <laughs> you know. What's up, Wayne? There wasn't no CLB1 talk. I just I just seen it. I didn't know that they that they cloned it. That's pretty crazy. I'm not gonna buy one. The only the only way I would buy that is if I recorded people. Like, there's no like 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 there's no reason for there's no reason for me to have that. If I, it, dude, if I recorded people, if I recorded people, I would get it because I've 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 got the seventy three. You know what I mean? So I I would have the seventy three and then the and and then and then that thing and then get a little TLM one hundred three. We'll have you know I go around telling people I had the Drake chain. You know what I mean? I could I I I could pay it off in like six sessions. Oh. Who's getting the stones throw? Yeah, who is getting the stones throw? MK2. I think that's I thought this was really cool. Give you a little, give you a little vinyl, give you a little cassette, you know. I must they want to charge you for it. They want to charge you nine hundred dollars for this. Fuck out of here, boy. Fuck out of here. At least Roland is tapping in with like, you know, with, you know, with their culture and shit like that. It's like, this is what people do. They get these and they get the skins, you know, so they, so they went out and they did like, they did like a legit collab that makes sense, you know. I think this is really cool of them to do it. Seven C's, you Seven C's, you know what that's about, bro. Keyflow, Keyflow came in the Discord po po posting that shit, and you know what that is, bro. Like these, you know, bro is an influencer now. You know what I'm saying? So the influencers gotta gotta run that affiliate link, and. Once everybody, you know, once everybody gets all set on their, you know, on their, uh, you know, on their, once everybody gets all set on their mixers, you know, then you gotta, then you gotta get an interface, you know? So you run around. <laughs> Yo. 